Hello and welcome to my unboxing and first look at the Necrons Silent King model. It's right here in this box. Let's crack on open with this. We've got a number of airbags, limited edition. We've got some dice, We've got the Chaplin on a bike. We've got the Primaris Invader ATV, Firestrike servo turret, the Codex. Now, I will be giving away this Codex in the Discord server, so there's never been a better time to hop on over to the Discord uh, server and uh, I will announce uh, the giveaway uh, there. So um, good luck to you all. We have the brand new whopping Space Marine Codex. Absolutely huge, 100 data sheets. Yeah, first look of this will be uh, later on today. We've got the Canoptec Doomstalker. We've got the Lock Hust Heavy Destroyer. We've got the Getting started with Warhammer 40k. I thought that would be an interesting uh, video. Uh, the book is, you know, all right, uh, but uh, this will we'll go through it uh, page by page. I hope you'll find it useful, especially if you're brand new and you uh, have got into 40k in this ninth edition. A lot can seem quite daunting when you're starting a new game system or, or Warhammer in general. Uh, so this will be a newbie uh, video. And then finally, right at the bottom, we have Necrons Sarek, the Silent King, three miniatures. He will set you back a whopping 95 pounds. Let's face it, it's pretty much 100 pounds, isn't it? Um, but what a stunning model. Of course, I'm very much looking forward to the other big models uh, from Necrons, such as the new Monolith and the Void Dragon. If we look at the reverse, you've got these two men here, men here. Mena. Anyway, uh, you've got these two. This is a scale ratio one by one, so this is exactly how big uh, he will be. Um, it's quite nice. Uh, looks absolutely incredible. If you can see all the detail and things there, you probably looked at many, many images and pictures of this. I like these two dudes with his different weapons. Um, absolutely incredible. So without further ado, let's unbox it. I wonder if you'd, yeah, you do get a tray unfortunately you don't get a i say fancy box you don't get a a different sleeve or any artwork that would have been nice for a model of this price uh, but there's the instruction guide now how to build the body that goes on the uh the base system i knew i knew it wasn't just connected with these uh arcs of energy or whatnot I knew there had to be a, a rounded base or something uh, that it would um, affix to. And it's also supported by these, these energy beams too. Wow, this is going to take a while. And uh, what we're going to do is I'm actually going to build him in the live stream on Wednesday evening. So uh, please do join me at 7 o'clock uh, BST for a a build of him i don't think i'm going to complete him in the uh in the time frame but uh i'm going to start at seven so i hope you join me and there he is right at the end the triarchal many uh look very very simple to build they're literally five pieces and then you get some of the rules i mean this is my first ever box set for um, 40k 9th edition so this is very very new to me I much prefer the old style uh, but yeah you can see sort of movement and and the, the reason why they've done this is just so that they can sell it in all the country and they don't need to uh, produce many more pages um, for the rules so that's a good thing if they're producing less uh, less pages how many sprues do you get three sprues so it's not a two sprue tech list but it is a three sprue Zarek um, for this price point, uh, you get these two bases for the menis. 
can even pick those up and you get this base it's not that big a base to be fair it's uh, not as big as it's certainly not as big as Archeon or anything like that if you were uh, interested so this is the first brew right here and uh, we'll have a good look at this um, this has the scepters and the weapons and the arms and the cloak cloak is awesome by the way uh, there it is as well uh, you've got some little wow that's amazing individual uh, little scarabs uh, baby scarabs um, scarablets <laughs> uh, you've got this awesome uh, coutage and uh, chain necklace thing uh, you've got these which oh, they, there's so much detail on that I mean can you believe it look at that look at the detail there that is insane that's the Amalia Novena kind of detail, that. Um, I like the little squares uh, the, on, the, uh, on the cloak. And this, and yeah, the head. There's loads of detail on the legs as well for Zarek. You've got the different heads, the loin guards. Another staff. So yeah, lots of pieces on that and uh, a lot of detail. These have uh, the menus. Um, and I think these two are duplicates. No way, there we go. Technically you're getting two sprues. Very sneaky, very, very sneaky. So these two are exactly the same. And then this one is different. This is very nearly a two sprue tech list. Very nearly, because these are exactly the same. For the men is and then you've got the uh, opposite sides of the crackling lightning um, you've got this as well you've got the armor pieces you've got cabling you've got uh, spines and legs and uh, cables and panels and the little control panel thingy um, I like the detail there with the cracked uh, stonework or whatever it is um, so yeah, there you go. Uh, if you have a look at these menus as well, there's there's a load of detail. There's there's um, some uh, glyphs, Necron glyphs, uh, indented in there. So that's great if you can get some shading in, I guess. Yeah. So that's cool. I mean, I'm impressed. Uh, I didn't expect the model of this price and this size to to have two identical sprues. I I wasn't expecting identical sprues in uh, a kit like this so that's odd so yeah you're getting two different sprues uh, but one of them is duplicated and I wasn't aware of that so that's an interesting revelation at least so what I'm going to do is put this to one side uh, for a couple of days and then I will go through and build it uh, with you on uh, Wednesday evening so if you're thinking about getting the model and you want some tips or you just want to join me and chill out in the live stream and uh, put a load of comments in and things then it'd be great to see you there what do you guys think of the model please do put your thoughts and opinions down below as always thank you ever so much for joining me today thank you for watching the flesh is weak